Hello. Welcome back to the channel. If you are into electronics, IoT, or embedded systems, learning how to design your own PCB is a game changer. In this video, I'll walk you through how to create a professional looking PCB using EasyEDA, a powerful and free online tool. EasyEDA is a free web based EDA tool that allows you to design circuit schematics, simulate them, and create PCB layouts. I designed this PCB using EasyEDA and ordered it from Lion PCB. The quality is excellent. Now, let's walk through the complete process how to design a PCB step by step using EasyEDA. All right, first open your browser and go to easyeda.com. Just sign up if you are new. I am signing in with my Google account. It's quick and convenient. After creating your account, click on Design Online and then choose the Pro Edition. Now you are on the editor page. Just click on New Project and give your project a name to get started. At the top of your project, you'll see tabs for board, schematic, and PCB. To start designing your circuit, go to the schematic tab and click on P1 to open it. Now we are in the schematic editor. This is where we build our circuit diagram. On the left side, you'll see a component library. You can search for parts like resistors, capacitors, ICs, connectors, and more. At the top, there's a component icon. Click on it to open the library, where you can search for all kinds of components directly from LCSC electronics, like microcontrollers, ICs, relays, and more. Let's build a relay module circuit diagram. So, add components, relay, connector, optocoupler, LED, NPN transistor like BC547, diode, and resistor. After adding those components, connect them as per the circuit diagram. After completing the circuit, click on Design, then select Update Schematic to PCB. Check all the boxes, then click on Apply Changes. Now you are in the PCB Layout Editor. Now arrange the components for a compact and clean layout. You can rotate any components by pressing the space bar for better positioning. After arranging all the components, it's time to route the traces. You can use the Auto Router to automatically generate the wire connections or route them manually for more control over the layout. Select the copper layer from the layer panel on the right side of the editor. You can switch between the top and bottom layers for a two-layer PCB.
To change the routing layer through a pad, simply double-click the left mouse button on it. This will create a wire and switch the trace to the other layer. As you can see, there's no separation between the high voltage AC and low voltage DC traces. For safety purposes, we can create a slot region between them to ensure proper electrical isolation. Select Fill Region and choose Polygon. Then use left clicks to define the region area. Once you've outlined the area with left clicks, right click to finish the shape. Then set the region type to slot region from the context menu and adjust the position. The slot region creates a physical gap on the PCB, adding insulation between high and low voltage lines. It helps prevent arcing or leakage making the circuit safer and more reliable. To export the PCB as a gerber file, click on the export icon and select export gerber and click on check DCR. If you want to order the PCB directly from JLC PCB, click on the order PCB icon you'll be redirected to the JLC PCB website. There, select the base material as FR4, set the layers to 2, choose the quantity, and pick your preferred PCB color. After selecting all your PCB options, click on Save to Cart. Finally, confirm your shipping details and complete the payment to place your order. And that's it. Your PCB design is ready and on its way to production. I hope this video helped you understand the full process using EasyEDA.